Hey guys, it's Pastor Jason, and I am dressed like a cow today because it's Friday, Friday, uh, Friday July the 13th, and today is CAD 2012, or Cow Appreciation Day 2012. So if you get this video today and you're, you're diligent on your emails and following up with my messages that I send you, you should dress like a cow and go to Chick-fil-A. If you are partially dressed like a cow, you get a free entree, but if you are fully dressed like I am, you get a free meal. And so I had a uh, number six meal. It was delicious with Coke Zero. And uh, that was really, really good. But I'm not here to talk to you about CAD 2012. I'm here to talk to you about Superhero Training Academy, which is our event this weekend. First of all, I want to say a special thanks. All of you guys who took some time to fast and pray this week. Thank you to Jose Reyes, who helped me film a video on Tuesday night. Thank you to uh, Francisco, to Jasmine, to Jenny, to Kesia to um, Jessica Solon was here for a little while. Justin Watts came. Boomy Feiga, you were awesome. You were here two days. Thank you for that. David Tamaya, thank you. Pedro Neira, thank you for coming and helping out. Um, no, Aaron Livingston, you were here. Thank you for helping out. I really appreciate Miss Betty Shrum. Um, all of you guys, KCF, I didn't mention your name. All of you guys who helped pull off this uh, facility and make everything ready and right and good for this weekend, I'm very excited. I think it's going to be pretty amazing. And I want to thank you guys again for all of your help and your time making sure everything's ready for this weekend. But that's but but let me go ahead. This is an overview. This first first of all, I want to say keep praying. I don't want just a fun weekend. I really want the Lord to show up in power. I want the message to be powerful. I want the worship to be powerful. I want the love of God through you guys to be powerful. There are a couple things I still need. We definitely need help at the 11 o'clock service. So if you serve Saturday night or if you serve at 9 and you know you're not bringing somebody to uh, YOLO weekend this weekend, or if you're out of town and you're seeing this video, come Sunday at 11. I need help. I need specifically female small group leaders and any worship team members for 11 o'clock this Sunday. So Boomi, Dyra, if you can help, I'm talking to you guys. Otherwise, be praying and then be here. Dress up not like a cow. Dress up like a superhero. I want to encourage the kids. I want to see how crazy your guys' costumes can be. Don't be lame about it, okay? I mean, if you have to be lame or wear nothing, be lame. Um, you, know, you can put on a little mask and a little S or something like that. And that could be your costume. Also, I'd encourage you to wear your costume to church because you're spreading the word about one way. You're getting other people excited. You know how it is. The Most of the church does not know what we're doing in here in one way. And this is a great opportunity for you to kind of literally wear on your sleeves. This is what I'm doing. This is how I'm serving the kingdom of God. This is how I'm making disciples by serving kids. So, um, so wear your costumes. Bring them to Sunday. Wear them to church if you would. Um, have fun with it. This is our chance to really live it up and be like kids and to love these kids. I'm going to go ahead and give you an overview. I'm going to show you the facilities and what we've done. And then I'm going to give you an overview of some of the things we're going to be doing. So don't go anywhere. Okay, so here's the entrance. As you see, we've kind of moved things around. Wave, Caleb. Say hi to everybody. There's Caleb. He's dressed like a cow. Did you get free Chick-fil-A today, Caleb? Yes. What would you eat? Chicken nuggets. And fruit cup? Yes. So here's the entrance the one way. It might look a little bit different. That's because we moved our registration desk and we're going to have a video playing there. And there's our city as you walk in and you can see the Superhero Training Academy logo. Uh, Self-check-in kiosks are there and there. And there's our guest registration. So we need somebody stationed there the whole time just to love and serve people. As we walk into one way, um, we've, we've added some things. We're still doing the epic movie kind of series idea, so that has stayed basically the same. As you can see, we're filming on the green screen this week, um, doing a Spider-Man activity during large group. They have to sling web at Dr. Octopus. Um, there, Saturday night, we're going to be doing our activities inside one way. On Sunday, we're going to be doing them upstairs in Building A. So here's one of our activities. Sunday morning, it'll be upstairs in A, but Saturday night, it's going to be right there. Kids are going to lay on the tables like they're flying. And then they shoot these power balls. They, they, they launch these bolts of energy at the bad guys. And you can see there's three of each color. They have to knock down their three bad guys. There's three blue and then three yellow. And once they knock down their three, they can try to defeat the boss. And they need to get a, be the first one to get a ball into the boss bucket to win and get a point for their team. Over here, we have these skyscrapers. We're going to have balloons on them. You might have to hang up the balloons with push pins. 
but kids will launch darts at the balloons that vaporize the villains. Only the red balloons are villains. If they pop any other color, they get negative points. So make sure they know to protect the citizens. That's kind of important. Outside, we're going to have an obstacle course. I think it'll be in, downstairs in A on Sunday, but it might still be outside. It's out behind Building A right now. And then finally, we have a, an activity. I don't have it out here, but they're going to be doing... Um, they're going to be solving code puzzle sheets, and um, a lot of them are just like rebus puzzles, you know, pictures, minus, plus letters, and things like that to sound out a word like Captain America or the Hulk or Thor or whatever. Um, but they're going to do it with an aqua bomb in their, in their lap. So basically, it's a time bomb. There's a water balloon in it. They have 20 seconds. If they solve it in the 20 seconds, you have to defuse the bomb. Otherwise, they're going to get very wet. So that's going to be another one of our activities, and that'll be a lot of fun. Um, Anyway, this is what I need you guys to do. Be creative and have fun. Design your costume. Be here early. I know sometimes you guys get here maybe 10, 15 minutes before service. Try to get here like 30 minutes before your service. That will help us with the kids, and that will help the kids. That way we're having adults here who are ready for them, welcoming them, loving them, greeting them. The goal for this weekend is we want every kid, whether they're an every week kid or a first-time kid, to feel absolutely loved by us and by God, our virtues love this, some, this month. So we're talking about God's love. Greater love knows not a man than this, than he would, who would lay down his life for his friend. That's what our message is. I want to live that and not just speak that. So I need you guys here, full of the Spirit, ready to love kids, ready to serve them, ready to minister to them in the name of Jesus and have fun with them. God bless you. Let me pray for you guys real quick. Jesus, I pray for all, every single one of these leaders watching this video and even those who are negligent to, to follow the link and watch the video, um, that you would bless them, that they would experience your presence this week. They're, they're going to hear your voice this week, that they're not just going to be talking the talk of Jesus, but they would walk in a depth of intimacy with you, to know you, to love you, to delight in you. Thank you, God, for these guys. Would you bless them and keep them? Would you minister through them with your power and your authority this weekend. In Jesus' name, amen. I love you guys. I'll see you guys Saturday night or Sunday morning. God bless you.